Y'all, listen, I'm trying to spill all the tea on my natural hair and how I got it like this. But I'm not even going to cap to y'all. This is a drawstring half wig. And I need you to keep on watching so I can tell you all about it. All right, y'all, so listen, this hair is from Her Giving Hair, and this is their new drawstring half wig. Yes, it's a drawstring, and it's a half wig. Sign me up, because it fits perfectly. I'm so excited. These are the goodies that it came with. I'm very happy that they sent these over, because the style that I'm using, I'm going to be using this one right here to style the hair. But this is how we're looking straight out of the packaging. The curls and texture is very pretty, but y'all know we're going to go ahead and define these curls. This is the look on the inside. You guys can see it is a half wig. It's so many styles that you can do with this, but for this video, this will be a how to define these curls and do a quick and simple install. You guys can check out my next video to see how I'm going to be styling it in a few more ways. But for now, I'm going to show you how to get to this from here so i like to go in with my lot of body and some type of leave-in when i'm working with more of a kinkier texture hair we want to make sure that it's hydrated so those curls can pop okay when working with curly hair over time i've learned that i like to finger detangle first and then i go in with a little bit more of my product and my dimming brush again I personally like to finger detangle first. It helps get that product work through all the strands. And then you can go in with your dimming brush, your paddle brush. This is what's going to really help those curls to define and pop. So you guys can see me right here using my dimming brush. I'm going to start from the end and work my way up. Y'all, don't be starting from the little scappy scalp part, okay? Do not start up to go down. You want to start at the ends of the hair and gradually work your way up i don't know if you guys can notice but in the back it was starting to dry quicker than i wanted it to so i did go ahead and take it off and redump the hair with light water and i'm working outside so i kind of got to be quick because the hair is naturally drying while i'm outside and i wanted that because i wanted this hair to be ready to wear in like less than 10 minutes so using um resources i'm outside doing it it's helping the hair dry or you can use a diffuser you can use a blow dryer but this is what i did for me for right now so i'm just making sure i'm working that product all the way through and you guys are seeing those curls pop like this is real time i'm not fast forwarding i'm not slowing it down this is what it's looking like also one thing i do want to mention is that the products that i'm using are very affordable but they work magic like i love granite fruit teas for my curly hair units it keeps it hydrated especially um when i'm using this method to you know define it i like to go ahead and apply and let it air dry and look at those curls i mean y'all i know y'all see the difference the definition on this hair is so beautiful and it gets so big and fluffy you guys gotta stay tuned to the end all the information on this hair is down below so if you want to check it out i think you should because not only is it a drawstring which helps for more security but because it's a half wig it's so much that we can do with this i'm i'm very excited to try my next styles on this but again that's in another video but yeah this is how she's looking and i'll be back to you guys to install I wanted to come back and show you guys this granite fruit tea sleek and shine serum sleek and shine serum oh my god sally sells she sells by the cheese that's what it sounds like but i like to use that on my damp hair and my dry hair because it helps reduce the amount of frizz that i get from my curly hair if you're someone like me that's likes big hair i'm gonna be teasing this hair later and this is a product that really helps to minimize that frizz so you do get more curl <laughs> install this wig we're going to be doing a low ponytail we're going to put it in a small bun we're going to throw on this half wig make sure the adjustable strap is adjusting to our head we're going to throw on that cute little stylish headband and call it a day like it's our own natural hair so simple y'all i installed this wig in under five minutes and it looks like i was growing it since i was a little girl it's this is absolutely my favorite way to install a wig i did it this way because i wanted to go work out that's how the drawstring looks in the back you're going to put it on your head reach in the back and use the drawstring 
Trust me, that's T. This is me playing around with where I wanted the wig to lay. So you guys are going to see in a few clips, I'm going to go ahead and move that a little bit closer to my forehead because I wanted less of my natural hair showing before I put on my headband piece. So it's okay to move it around and figure out what you want for you. But for this hairstyle, I chose to move it a little bit closer because my headband is going to do the rest for me. Like I didn't use no product to mold down my hair. I just simply brushed it back in a low ponytail put on this wig and this is me teasing her to get her a little more volume look at the definition on these curls like i'm so in love go ahead and grab your hairstyling accessory i'm going ahead and using what came with the hair love it it went with the outfit it was very much giving what i wanted to give and you're just going to adjust it to your liking and y'all that's it if you want to stop right here that's you but for me i like a little volume you know what i'm saying tease from the root leave those ends alone okay tease it tease it tease it from the root i am going to go ahead and go in with my big wide tooth comb also at first i thought my fingers could do the trick but you know ain't nothing wrong with having a little assistance so i did go ahead and grab my wide tooth comb after i did my hair flip then y'all see it's secured that also helps with volume by the way but a comb is even better go ahead and take it and tease it from the root like i'm showing you guys right here and that's really it that's all i did i am gonna go back in with my garnet fruities sleek and shine serum oh i finally said it right only a downsize amount y'all do not need a lot go ahead and make sure you're working it on your ends and at the top of your hair and you're good to go don't forget all the information on this hair will be down below shout out to her giving hair this new construction is amazing i'm so in love and i can't wait to see how i'm gonna style it next if you found this video helpful don't forget to give me a big like and subscribe to my channel to come take off for me and i hope to see you in my next video bye y'all